Hello, any references to the reality is completely random. I'm an Italian girl and when I go to the supermarket, I usually dress like that. You see, like the first thing I find in the closet, I just put it on. And I love to stay in the supermarket. I would stay in the supermarket even three hours. I love to read all the different ingredients and to find ideas. As you see, I use a lot my hands. I move a lot my hands. This is something really, really Italian. And um, I love to cook. Every day I cook as much as I can. It depends if I have time from work, but I love to cook ravioli, parmigiana, lasagne, homemade pasta, Mexican food, sushi, but a new version that I invented and uh, anything, cakes, uh, ice cream. I love to cook and I really believe that food, uh, it's so important. It's so important to put fantasy inside of the food because uh, uh, then you, you share it with the family and it's a beautiful moment of uh, uh, keeping the family together. And yes, I also, um, uh, I study interior design, I project retail furniture and uh, I am a real estate agent. I pay my own bills and uh, uh, I believe that men should not pay. I believe that women should pay their own bills. Uh, but even if uh, um, I'm also an artist and I make painting with hot glue and when I do that with the hot glue I always hurt myself, I hurt my arms, I hurt my uh, hands but I love it so much uh, that I really don't care about hurting myself and um, I think I'm, I'm good in what I'm doing but I don't know why my ex-boyfriend in the past now no, always cheated me. Yes, cheated me with the girl that sells the fish that she even smelled not so good. And uh, she, he cheated me with the secretary, with my cousin, with everybody. And I really don't know why, because I was trying to do my best, but it didn't work. And what I want to say uh, to you is that um, I travel a lot in Europe and I don't tell you where, but somewhere in Europe I found places where there are girls, always without generalized, but there are some girls that they go to the supermarket and they look almost like that. One second, I come back immediately. I will be very, very fast. One second. Oh my god, oh my god, oh my god, I'm going, I'm going, oh. okay, they look almost like that, and they, like this, they go to the supermarket, and they don't like it, they don't care, and they go like that, and they, they don't really care, they, they don't like to cook, and when it's time to lunch, this kind of girl, she just put a box of butter on, on the table and just some uh, bread she she bought but not the good one just the the one that uh, lasts for a long time and some already cut at hand and this is the lunch this kind of girl usually don't speak she's like she doesn't speak she doesn't speak and um, uh, this kind of girl, usually she is not funny, she really doesn't make video on YouTube, definitely she does not do that. And um, uh, she uh, she's very quiet uh, and she doesn't do much, let's say. Um, also her kids usually are very quiet, they don't really do a lot of noise, everything is very very quiet and Ital Italian kids are not like that, Italian kids are like bam boom ba 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 when an Italian kid enter into the restaurant everybody go away, they, 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 they tell you no never never bring your kids in this restaurant again because um, I don't know we have a lot of patience you know and um, uh, in this family, in this kind of family, usually there is not so much conversation because, uh, of course, nobody speak, uh, nobody's funny, and they don't even call to each other because, of course, why do you have to call each other if you don't speak? Of course, in Italy, it's the opposite. We 
we we call each other continuously we call each other even if we don't have really nothing to say we just call each other and uh, yes i call it you i didn't have nothing to say but i just call you you know and all i want to say is that uh, uh, this kind of girl usually it's incredibly successful uh, their husband really loved them uh, and they never cheated them and the girl doesn't speak she's like but after like five years she say like, uh, buy me a diamond ring. And the, the husband immediately is like, yeah, of course, it's the first thing you say in five years. And the husband immediately is like, yeah, yeah, okay, here, here, the, the diamond ring, you know. Or, or when she speaks, she always asks something like, uh, do that, clean that, fix that. She doesn't say nothing else. And she's very really successful. The reason why the the world world work like that is because this kind of girl they don't put men in competition they are very simple they are very easy uh, so the man uh, is more relaxed if uh, the man uh, have a relationship with a girl that is smart and creative um, he feel in competition and this is uh, for them uh, is very stressful but I did this video for a reason uh, statistically the um, 98% of commission are men, only the 2% are girls. And what I want to tell you, this is very a really, really sad statistic. I really want that there are more commission girls. But not just this, of course, you know that only the 20% of politicians are girls. And I really believe this is so wrong. I really believe that the world should change. And if there would be more funny and eccentric and a girl that want to express themselves no matter what you want to do because if you want to do uh, if you want to be a doctor uh, uh, a lawyer anything you want to do you can uh, do it in your unique way and you can express yourself in that so this is what I want to tell you is that don't be afraid of expressing yourself because in the, um, in the worst case you will have a lot of girlfriends and a lot of gay friends that are gonna love you and support you and of course even if there are just a few there are a few men in the world that are able to um, support a sophisticated and clever uh, woman there are just a few but if we have less shut up and pretty girl and um, butter box girl and we have uh, uh, more uh, girls that are not afraid of expressing themselves uh, we will uh, um, we will also have more men that are uh, going to appreciate uh, a girl that actually speaks and not just shut up and be pretty so uh, the last thing i want to say is that butter is very bad for the health you should use olive oil in italy we use olive oil and we live so much longer because uh, um, the alimentation is the first uh, um, uh, things for the cardiac problems that is the first uh, um, uh, uh, sorry the first uh, reason why uh, people died so uh, less shut up and be pretty girl and more uh, artistic uh, expressive original girl in the world be cool and thank you so much bye bye